Ho ho, my hearties, dinky do. A very good evening to you, Scotty McClue, just for you with our Sunday night pop up. Half an hour of wonderful, superb entertainment, information, education, and of course the shout outs, the mentions to every single one of you live. On Facebook Live, that's what it's all about. Make sure you spread the word right now and tell Ted, to tell Ted, to tell Ted, to tell Ted that Scotty McClue is live. Dinky do and welcome, 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 I say. Now, time is always tight. There's Alice Blakemore. Hi, Scotty. Julianne Scott. Hello, Scotty. Good evening, sir. Says Lindsay. Yeah. Good evening, Lindsay. Dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. And of course, lots happening tonight. So there we are. James Cotters and Craig Matheson are joining us in the run time. Lewis Cunningham, Jeff Bernstein. There's a happy face. I would hope so, Jeff. We should always have a happy face if we can. Admittedly, there are a lot of challenges out there. But if we can, that's what it's all about. We should try and sport a happy face. Me an effort not to take things too seriously. Whatever will be, will be. There's Wedge, Dinky Doo, Scotty McClure, says Wedge, and you, Wedge. Lovely to have you with us, and Dinky Doo to you. How are you doing, Scotty, says Alice. Very, very good, Alice. It's been a quite outstanding week. So wonderful stuff, and lovely to have you all with us. Can't wait for your show, says Wedge. The show starts at 10 o'clock tonight on Nation Radio, 96.3 on the FM, or www.nation radio.scot. You can't go wrong. Hello, mate, says Kevin Wiggum. Hello, mate, says Scotty McClure to Kevin Wiggum. Good evening, Scotty, says Mr. McGrew. Neil O'Gormley, good evening, sir. Good evening to you, sir. Lovely to have you with us. I doff my cap to you, I say. If you've just joined us, you're watching Scotty McClure. Scotty, can you tell Charlene to give me a smile? I can indeed. Glenn Ferguson. Good evening, Scotty. Good evening, Glenn. I've enjoyed your feedback on Facebook. Excellent stuff. Very, very good. Wonderful Scotty McClure, says Alice. Dinky do, Alice. It's fantastic. Uh, Dinky do, Scotty. How are you, sir? Says Brian Wilson. Brian, I am excellent. Lovely to hear from you. And of course, good to have everyone along because I know time's very, very tight on a Sunday night now. This is show 122. So 122 shows since we did our first Saturday night, late night pop-up, just taking a wee chance on it, and here we are, three and a half million viewers later. Hi, Scotty, I listen from Yorkshire. Peter Lockwood, that's fantastic stuff. There's people listening all over the country. How far is the studio from you, says Wadge. Not too far at all, Wadge. So nice and handy, I would say. There you are. Wow, congratulations. Excellent stuff, and congratulations to you. I think you'll find that the Scotty McClure Nightline on Nation Radio 96.3 is going to become the talk show for the UK. Stephen Bart McDowell. Good evening, Scotty. Good evening to you, Stephen. Lovely to have you with us. Ryan William Rear. Hi, Scotty. Good to see. You. Can't wait to hear you on the radio. I shall be going on at 10 o'clock sharp. Nation Radio 96.3. Scotty, give Carol Cameron a shout out from Kirk of Shots. Excellent. Yeah, big dafty. Give us a shout out. Who is that? You big daft. Stephen Hamilton. Ha <laughs> ha. you, you big dafty. Thank you very much, sir. You're a gentleman. Been helping you get through my Friday and Saturday night shifts. Driving a cab in Glasgow. Tell all the taxi drivers in Glasgow and in Edinburgh and everywhere. Gary Latto. Dinky do, big fellow. And to you, sir. Are you live at 10? Live at 10, Alice. Dinky do from Les Hoy MBE Dreammaker Foundation. I thank you, Les Hoy MBE Dreammaker Maker Foundation, and I am glad to know that the British Empire is in such fine hands. Oh, wonderful. So there we are. Uh, Lindsay Kerr, remind us how we can listen on the show, Scotty. You can listen, Lindsay, on 96.3 on the FM, or you can go to www.nationradio.scot and you'll get it online right away. Or you can go to the App Store and download either TuneIn or um, 
radio player. If it's tune in, just stick in Nation Radio Scotland. If it's radio player, stick in Nation Radio 96.3 FM Scotland. And that will be you and I umbilically linked. You can't go wrong. And it's the most fantastic radio station. It's on now, of course. So there you are. You can also get yourselves on via your uh, Amazon Echo. And you can shout, um, Alexa, play Nation Radio Scotland. Alexa, play Nation Radio Scotland. Uh, hi, this is Jean Stewart. Hi, Jean, lovely to have you with us. Linda Ireland watching. Xander James Stewart. Hi, Scotty. Terry McMillan. Oi, you missed mine out. I'm sorry, Terry. We're back there. It's just so busy on here. Love you, man. Hi from Dumfries, says Lee Shanley. Dinky do, man. And love to add the Dune Hamers Dune in Dumfries. Shocking, Scotty. No, not at all. The wonderful Berta King Patterns watching. Dinky do, Berta. Linda Ireland's all smiles. A lovely lady. Gary Ball. Happening from Glasgow. Oh, happening big style from Glasgow. Uh, hi, says Alice. Hi. Hi. Good morning, Scotty from Australia. How are you? Says Erica Meyer. I'm fine, Erica. It's brilliant. Lovely, lovely, lovely to have so many of you with us. Hello, Paul. Hope you've had a good weekend, says Thomas. I have, Thomas. Yes, indeed. Hatisfaction guaranteed with that hat. Tell the hat's wonderful, isn't it? Uh, Lee Shelley, can I tell Lynn Duncan? I love her, please. Of course you can. Ian McManus. Hi, Scotty. Gerard McGark. Dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. Excellent stuff. Spread the word. Can we all start sharing as soon as possible, guys? Because we've got so much to get through tonight. And, uh, of course, as always, so little time to do it in. I only have the half hour. You're not on radio tonight. Radio at 10 o'clock sharp, Gary Ball. Why would I not be on the radio? For goodness sake. Scott McClure is always on the radio somewhere. So there we are. It might not be where you are, but he's always on somewhere and everybody can hear it. You're on the ball, old pal, says Gerard McGuck. You too, Gerard. Happy Monday evening, says John Cameron. Yes, we're going to end up into Monday. Love your cap. How is the fox? The fox is wonderful. He's treating the place as a motorway now, and he just nips through. And he goes, hi, Scott, he won't be long, just going on the sniff. So there we are, fantastic. He's got me foxed. I can tell you, brilliant. Wonderful, wonderful stuff. Now, I'm just seeing what's happening here and uh, getting you back so we can do a bit of sharing. Scotty, Alexa doesn't recognize my good Ayrshire accent. He <laughs> says, Brian Wilson, don't worry, Brian, I shall do it for you. This is for Brian Wilson's house. Alexa, play Nation Radio Scotland. Excellent. So there you go, Brian. So Alexa should be starting up, firing up Nation Radio for you. Gary Ball, how's things? Excellent, Gary. Thank you for asking. Very much appreciated. If you've just joined us, folks, and you're wondering what on earth's going on, you're watching Scotty McClure, the world's top broadcaster and the first lord of the internet. And we're live right across Facebook. Excellent stuff. Stephen McCallum, dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. Bit of sharing needed guys here we go extra stuff remember television's off at 10 o'clock sharp have you managed to crash the phone line yet scotty mark it's been a very close thing we've been stowed out the door and step it through with Carlos. three nights running alexa play nation radio scotland so there you are that's it terry mcmillan nation radio scotland Excellent stuff. No Radio Scotland. That's another thing altogether. That's 40 years old, by the way. That's the British bottom cream, the BBC. There we are. So wonderful. So when you're giving Alexa instruction, make sure you get it right. I'm, I'm sure I'm going to work for the BBC someday, you know. And um, because it's early, early days in my wonderful career, and I first applied for the BBC in 1975. So I'm sure it's going to come up one of these days. Uh, probably they're keeping me on file for something suitable. That'll be what it's about. Um, he's got Century FM, Scotty. There we are. Steve Burrows. Yes, she used to come and join us at Century FM. That was a fabulous, fabulous station as well. There's the wonderful Neil Greenslade. 
Hi, Neil. Dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. So there we are. I've got some serious work for you, Neil. So there we are. I shall be talking to you at some point. You and I will be speaking big style because I've got some serious work for you that I want to uh, get across as quickly as possible. And um, I just got some great news. So there you are. Uh, Ronnie Stevenson, Dinky do. Lovely to have you with us. Top man, what are you angling for, Ronnie? Oh, ho, ho. did you see what I just did there? Ronnie's a fisherman, folks. So there you are. So a merry jeep. Martin Mark and Dinky Doo, lovely to have you with us. You should go on Classic FM, says Gary Ball. Well, I know all the songs, and I know all the tunes, and I should say Mozart's Aviviram. Live just for you on Classic. You're listening to Scotty McClue. <laughs> uh, can I call you Scotty McClure? Of course you can, John Robertson. 01418110475 after 10 o'clock. Uh, Paul Sefton, I remember you were interviewed by Nicky Campbell. That was hilarious. The wonderful Nicky Campbell. Yes, it did. That was huge. National television. Is that your house, Scotty? So there you are. Well, I'm renting it for the moment. So there you go. And um, it's got to go back at midnight. Uh, excellent stuff. Now then, that's the wonderful David Manson there. And of course, we had Paul Sefton. Can we get some sharing going here? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Share, 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 share. Uh, where am I on here? I'm having a look. Can't find myself on here. We are broadcasting live, aren't we? Yes. Lord McClure, says Stephen Peter Callum. Somebody's on last night saying, uh, there's Ronnie Stevenson saying, nutcase. Well, at least you're honest, Ronnie, and we respect that. So there you are. There are plenty of nutcases out there that wouldn't admit it. So thank you for that. Excellent. Uh, David Manson, dinky do. Yes, yeah, so somebody on last night, uh, Stephen P. McCallum, talking of Lord McClure and saying, I should be in the House of Lords. I've been around long enough. That was what I was getting. Hope you have a good time in the radio tonight, Gary Ball. I always have a good time in the radio. In fact, I have a ball. <laughs> did you see what I just did there? Fantastic. Ian Judge, Dinky do. Uh, Jock Burns, hello, Jock. Stop your tickling, Jock. Oh, stop your tickling, Jock. There we are. Lovely to have you with us, John. Excellent stuff. And Dinky do from Scotty McClure, the world's top broadcaster. How are you enjoying being back on the radio, says Martin Morrigan. Martin. It's fantastic. It's a breath of fresh air for me, and it's a breath of fresh air for the audience and you. So there we are. Uh, you would run amok in Parliament, so Stephen P. McCallum. I think so. In the House of Lords, I'm just wondering if Scotland should have a House of Lords, an upper chamber. There we are for sending everything forward. Look forward to 10 p.m. says Ian Judge Dinky Dorian. Lovely to have you with us. Then we could sort out all that Brexit nonsense. There you are. I think there's always an alternative. We could cancel it. There you are. What would you think of that? That would be rather good, wouldn't it? Cancel it. Ah, Right. I'm uh, coming back on here. I'm working away on a device as well, simultaneously. Looking forward to 10 p.m. Excellent stuff. We all are. If you've just joined us, folks, welcome, welcome, welcome. Facebook Live, Scotty McClue, just for you, saying dinky do. Now, we've only got minutes. I've got about uh, 20 minutes, just under 20 minutes. And then I have to dash off, dash off uh, to go live on the radio for all of you. So make sure you're there. Excellent stuff. But isn't it fantastic that we're at show number 122? 122. Who remembers the old Sam 122? I joyed when to the house of God go up, they said to me, Jerusalem within thy gates, thy feet shall standing be. Oh, what about that? They'd have the Honourable House of Lord McClure. Yes, McClueism. That's the next thing. We've had Thatcherism and um, Mayism and all these isms. What about McClueism? And reorganise. I'd reorganise the whole lot. I really would. I think probably I'd um, have the four first ministers um, on an equal footing, and they would form a sort of upper cabinet. So there you are. Excellent stuff. Big shout out. 
from Montefri Hill House in Hamilton, Tony Monte Montague, Montague or Montague, what do you like to call yourself? Some people call themselves Montague or Montague, because I remember being uh, uh, around uh, a chap who was in the army, and he said that um, this chap had said, uh, he said, Montague, take a step forward. He said, Sergeant, it's Montague, he said. Right, take two days, fatigues. So there we are. Uh, you should do live radio on Facebook. It would build a bigger audience. Martin Morrigan, you will not build a bigger audience than Nation Radio, I can assure you. We've already had three and a half million have watched Scotty McClure on Facebook. So there you are. Fantastic stuff. And I've just started broadcasting on YouTube. So if you get to the Scotty McClure YouTube channel, just put in Scotty McClure YouTube channel and you will see me broadcasting on there as well and follow me and subscribe to scotty McClure on youtube www.youtube.com forward slash user forward slash and then scotty McClure one or one word there you are wonderful stuff so yeah it's all live it's huge can we have a scottish house of lords yes so we can find enough people that can sleep all day gary cross and that's harsh and savage on their lordships Right? On lordships and, and lady esses and all that sort of thing. Because what they're actually doing when you see them sitting back with their eyes shut is they're listening to a certain broadcast system in the house which is in the back of the seats. See? Yes, Bale's an idiot, should never see a job half done. So there you are, and McClure will always tell you what is what. There's the wonderful Kate O'Connor. Hi, Scotty, it's Kate from the West End in Glasgow. Kate, you must be the only Kate of the West End in Glasgow. And I say dinky-doo to you, and welcome back to the land of McClure. First class. So there we go, Joseph Oskis. Joseph Oskis, what a lovely name, Oskis. Wonderful stuff. Peter Lockwood, Brexit Euro leaders still bossing us about. They don't get it, do they? Uh, Theresa May uh, couldn't build a cabinet. <laughs> and he mentions a big furniture house. Wonderful stuff. No, she's done very well. Uh, what radio channel, FM or me? Uh, uh, M-E, no, no, uh, FM. Right, 96.3 in the FM Lee Shadley, if you're in central Scotland, and if you're not, go online, nationradio.scot. Couldn't be easier, and there's no excuse. Uh, so wonderful. Uh, Chris McCauley, dinky do, right, we've got this, all this coming up. I'll have a look into that. Uh, John O'Rourke, excellent. You'd go in there like Gordon Ramsay shouting, shut it down. <laughs> He's wonderful. What a character. I could sleep all day, says Gary Ball. I think we could all sleep all day, especially at this time of year. I'm sure that we are built for hibernation. And, um, you know, we don't hibernate enough, but then we wouldn't get anything done, you see. They don't want everybody having a kip. Uh, seize the day. I don't, you'll not see that. It'll be the other way around. Seize the day. A quote from Horace. Hmm. Ooh, that's lush. Fantastic. So there we go. Who have we got here? Um, David Russell, Dinky Do. How are you? Excellent to have you with us watching Scotty McClue, show number 122, saying Dinky Do just for you. Fantastic stuff. Right, did we get some sharing done there? Do I need to get some sharing done, folks? Very, very important. Share, 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 share. Good evening, sir. I have to say, Nation Radio is awesome. Someone who relies on radio whilst at work, the tunes are great. That's why it's been designed like that. They've got all the top, top, top radio people working on Nation Radio, programming it and presenting it. And running it, the big bosses are absolute radio, 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 all the time. It's your pal from Australia, and Logan Kerr. How are you doing? I'm fine, my darling. Lovely to hear you. There's Jason McCaig. Wonderful stuff. Dinky-doo, Jason. Good evening to you. Dinky-doo, boss. 
Now, what have we got here? Scotty needs his own sketch show. Scotty and Limmy, can you imagine? Stephen P. McCallum. I'd hope to get a wee part in Still Game. I think that would be rather good, wouldn't it? Now, there we are. Good evening, Scotty, says Gavin Hull Sibley. What regiment were you in, Scotty, says Tony Monty Montague. Oh, I can't talk about that, Tony Monty Montague. A few weeks ago, love your show. There was a poor chase joke. I hope I never offended you. No, I'm sure you didn't. And uh, D. Gourley, so there you are. Although I am easily offended, as you know. Good evening, says D. Gourley. Good evening, D. Lovely to have you with us. And uh, excellent stuff. Can we all do some sharing? Share, 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 share. Let's get these numbers up big style. One, ah, there I am. Can you see me broadcasting to you? Right, that's me broadcasting to you. Hang on. There you are. Right, that's me broadcasting to you guys. Can you see that? I'm talking to you. Kathleen Barnes, dinky do. Excellent stuff. And what I'm going to do, I'm just going to do a bit of sharing. So if you can all do the same, that lets everybody on Facebook Live know that we are here. Dinky do. Excellent stuff. The wonderful Neil Greenstreet there. What a top man. A big name in radio and it's been fabulous to meet you. Um, I was thinking, Scotty, but it's all wrapped up now. You could cause plenty of polite mayhem. Yes, but there'll be other opportunities. As I say, I've been applying to the BBC since um, 1975, and I've already had a week's work, so it's all good stuff. They must like me in there. I can tell you that for nothing. Makir Pevrel, Dinky Doo, Richie McCusker. And, uh, and they've always got new people joining, you know, so there we go. Right, here I am. I'm just going to share to you lot first. Right, I'll do that. So I'm sharing to you lot, and then away we go. Share, 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 share. That lets them know that we're live right now, and I'll just pop up here for you. Live now, L-I-V-E, and uh, where is it? Hang on, here we go. Uh, marvellous. L-I-V-E. Come on, come on, come on, you should be doing the same. What are you waiting for? Live now. And off I go. I'm just going to share that round. Wonderful, wonderful, wonderful. And that's them all getting that. There we are. <clears throat> right. Good. Okay, that's a bit of sharing for you. And that will uh, let them know what's happening. Big style on here. And if you can all do the same, as I say, uh, tell Ted, tell Ted, tell Ted, that Scotty McClure's live. Shout out to Kieran, Kieran Crilly. Okay, Don, replying to Anne. Hi, Auntie Anne. Miss you, says D Gurley. So there you are. Now, Dee's talking to Anne, who's in Australia. Australia, you see. So there you are. I've got my bush hat, and I could put that on for you. Fantastic stuff. So get sharing, guys. Come on. Very, very important, because time's tight. We're live on Nation Radio at 10 o'clock. And I need to sort of uh, get sorted out, get everything, sort my hair out. I have to attend makeup, obviously, because it's the radio, you see. Um, are you allowed to cut people off on the phone in like you used to do? That was the funniest part. I can, Paul Sefton, but I'll tell you what's happened. We've got a rather stylish phone in going. So I'm not getting as many idiots on as I used to. So I don't have to cut them off. Uh, from that point of view, but we'll look at that, you see. Evening, Mr. McClure, says David Nagus. Fantastic stuff. There's a bit of a lobby out for Scotty McClure to become the program at Hogmanay with Scotty McClure's Hogmanay Bash. Fantastic. David Nagus. Evening, Mr. McClure. Michael McGuigan, I'm hungry. You're always hungry, Michael McGuigan. You were a bit cheeky to me, Michael McGuigan. You'd better take that back. So there you are. Yes. Aha. Uh -huh. Calling me a Tory. Oh, Michael McGuigan. So there you are. So you take that back, China. Right, there you are. That's him. Hi, Scotty. This is Rich Clues. Hi, Rich. Dinky do. Lovely to hear from you, of course. And I hope you're getting yourself sorted out with the Brexit and all that sort of thing. So there we are. Have we shared? 
that's very important. I'll just share now, and I'll share to our group as well and let them know. So get the sharing going, folks. Send it round. You can see McClure Broadcasting live on Facebook Live. There I am here, see? Excellent stuff. Give Kathleen Buns a shout out. She's new to your show. Tony Monte Montague, Kathleen Buns, welcome, welcome, welcome to Scotty McClure's Sunday evening pop-up, show number 122. Three and a half million of you have seen it. Uh, you wet, Michael. You called him. I uh, can't even say it. They're good, Stephen P. McCallum. That'll sort these people. Somebody called you such a low thing, Scotty. Is that not banned? Is that not a lifetime banned? You are mellowing right enough, McClue, says John O'Rourke. No, no, John O'Rourke, just a lot of manners. I mean, everybody said, oh, the world's changed. He'll no last on that station. They get flung off for shouting at somebody. Well, they can't say that now, can they? Scotty McClue's Hogmanay Bash, I'll be there for that, says Brian Wilson. It would be massive, Brian. I've still to speak to the big bosses. Should be away to the studio, have a cup of tea and a biscuit. No, David, listen, I've got, I'm not having a biscuit, because... If I took a digestive and it, a crumb went the wrong way, it could be disastrous. There's the wonderful Shujat Ali. Dinky doo Shujat Ali. What a top man. Ronnie Mulligan. All right, Scotty. Gary Ball says good night. You're on the ball tonight, Gary. Excellent stuff. Mm. Oh, that's lovely. It's so lush. It's wonderful. And I've got lovely stuff as well. So there you go. Now, do I have to dash? Yes, in about five minutes' time. Can we all have another share? So they are wonderful, Shujat Ali, one of our great business people in this country, an absolute top man, big radio man. So Shujat, I say to you, dinky do from Scotty McClure. And um, John Kelly, hello, Scotty. And he's a man after my own heart. He capitalizes it. Somebody asked why I capitalize the first letter of every word I post on Facebook. It's because every word I say is very, very, very important. Right? So that's why I do it. Crumble, he 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 says David Negus. A bit of crumble. We like that. The apple crumble and the rhubarb crumble. What about a couple of scoops of soft ice cream? Who? What about a wee dash of cream? What about custard? So there you are. We might ask people about that tonight. I've shared on Facebook and liked and followed and tweeted out. And followed on Twitter as well, Scotty. Good Kate. Everybody should do that. Hear you later, Scotty. Ta-ta for now, says D. Gurley. John Kelly says ta-ta. Scotty, I'd love to do a short documentary piece on you after the new year. What do you think? I don't mind at all, Paul. Let me know what you're needing. Mr. Banter, Scotty, says Keith Douglas. Look forward to the phone in, Scotty. Great shows, says Steve Burrows. Roddy Mulligan says the boy's bike's been stolen in Lockerbie, Scotty. I'm on the hunt for them. Get that boy's bike back, you Lockerbie people. So there you are. Just if somebody's taken a wee boy's bike in Lockerbie, get it back now, tonight. Back outside the house you took it from. Okay? This is Lockerbie we're talking. All right? So come on. Custard or honeycomb ice cream, Scotty? Hmm... Interesting, David Negus. We like that one. That's an absolute belter. So there we go. And uh, have you shared and shared and shared and shared and shared and shared? I'm just going to share to a page. <coughs> Pardon me. We want a statue of Scotty McClure. I know that we're talking about putting up a statue of, was it, was it another one of Thatcher or something like that? And I thought, put Scotty McClure up there. Something that the folk want, they, just the people actually would appreciate. There we are. Although the pigeons might not appreciate. I don't want 
the old bronze bonnet getting poo pooed on by the pigeons. Alan McDonald, dinky do lovely to have you with us, I say. Now, right, where am I sharing to here? Scotty McClue's page. There's another Facebook page, guys. Well, there's several Facebook pages for Scotty McClue. So go on and like the lot, I say. Right, I'm just going to publish this. I'm just going to put live uh, now. Keep everybody up to date. You should all be sharing yourselves by now that, you know, I've been spoon-feeding you for two years. It's over two years since we started the Scotty McClue pop-ups. I think that's absolutely fantabulous. I'm pretty sure Thatcher's got a statue in the Falklands with 24-hour protection, says Stephen McCallum. Ah, talking of the Falklands, go on to YouTube and put in Scotty McClure St. Andrew's Broadcast, Falklands. And you'll find out all about St. Andrew's Night. I go live to the Falkland Islands, right out on the Falkland Islands. It's fantastic stuff. So get on there and dinky-do, I say. Gordon Main, welcome, welcome, welcome. Replying to Ronnie Mulligan, I'm sure you'll get the bike back and make it too hot to handle. Yes, Scotty McClue orders everybody in Locker Bay to check out for the Wayne's bike to come back to where it was taken from. Will do, sir, says Stephen P. McCallum. You'll enjoy that, Stephen. Two years. Thanks. It flew in. Paul Sefton, it has flown in. Scotty McClure has been popping up for two years. And somebody said, Scotty, great to have your 50th show. I'll bet you'll have a 100th. We're on one, two, two. Uh, so there we are. And uh, somebody talked about, I was in the Faultless War in 1982, says Brian Wilson. Brian Wilson, I thank you and your ilk for everything you did for everyone there. Not an easy shift, that. Get yourself into George Square, Scotty. Beautiful full credit to the council, says Matthew Roberts. Scotty McClure, right in the middle of Glasgow. A big stature. Uh, your bike's still coming back, says Dan McLeod. Dan McLeod, rest assured, that bike will be back. Yes, you don't cross Scotty McClure. Okay, so there we are. Wonderful stuff. Now, I've got to go. It's half past nine. I don't want to go, but I've got to go because I'm live on Nation Radio 96.3 FM at 10 o'clock sharp. And it's the phone in. It's Scotty McClure's Nightline. So make sure every single one of you is listening in. Nationradio.scot is the URL for the internet for online 96.3. Every time I hear her name, it gives me the dry book. He's talking about Mrs. Thatcher, I think. And uh, think the bikes in Dumfries, says Lee Shanley. Right, it comes back from Dumfries. Julianne Scott, Nosta, Scotty, Nosta, Nosta to you, I say to you. And all the best, Scotty. I'll be listening to Stephen McCallum. I'm going to have to sing the song already. ready. There's Catherine Ed McClendon. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Take care, everybody, as you go. Goodbye, everybody. A wheat are thing, au revoir, and a cheerio. Ta-ra, my darlings. Have a great show, says Gary Crossan, and you, my loves, because you're joining me live on Nation Radio, 96.3 on the FM, at 10 o'clock sharp. Dinky-doo. Scotty McClure has left the building. Oh, yes. <laughs>